How's that? Good. Good? Alright, door seatbelt. Well, should be good to go. Ready to get your foot on the brake? Yep. Okay. Got you in here. Then you the door. This is way smaller than I thought. Go up full forward. Way smaller than what? Than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> yeah. What's your name? Uh, Michael. Michael, I'm Chris. Nice to meet you, Chris. Nice to meet you as well. Well, we are getting ready to go out. We're going to do four laps of Talladega Grand Prix Raceway here in the McLaren 570S. And we're going to have a good time. Awesome. So what brings you out here today? So uh, my boss is here, and he, I do sales. Yeah. And I had a good month in October. This is my reward. Oh, right on, dude. Well, congrats. So, and he, of course, he, he came with some sales with his son. Oh, sure, sure. Good deal, man. Well, I'm glad, I'm glad you get to experience this then. Yeah, this is uh, definitely a um, bucket list. I've always wanted to drive a McLaren. Okay. So, not, you know, not it's not an F1 GTR, but that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> I see. The, yeah, you're, you're talking some real money there. Yeah, like three million bucks for, <laughs> if you can find one. Right. All right, so Michael, when we get out on track, I'm going to use my voice and my hands to talk to you. So, okay. fist outs break, right? Right. Okay. Light break, medium break. I'm going to give you those qualifiers before we get into that braking zone. If you hear me say hard break or heavy break, that means we done messed up somewhere. Okay. And we need to get this car slowed way down. All right. Hand out, palm down means you can't accelerate. Okay. When we're done, I'm going to turn my palm up or to lift up off the throttle. I gotcha. Instead of using left and right, I'm going to use your side and my side. And biggest thing, especially today, make sure you're giving me three feet on each side of this car. The track's not very wide, and there's not there's really not any good runoff, like the grass drops off, anything like that. So we definitely don't want to drop a tire anywhere. Yeah, that'll cost 200 bucks, right? Exactly. <laughs> so just make sure you're giving me three feet on to the edge of the track everywhere around the course, and we'll be good. Now we'll go over the cones real quickly, just kind of so it's in your mind. And then when we get out on track, you'll see all those and we'll kind of go over them again. But you have a pair of yellow cones. Those are gonna be your lift cones. So that's another visual cue. Uh, red cones are your brake markers. Again, another visual. Both the yellow and the red are gonna let you know what side of the track to be on. So if you see yellows or reds on my side, we're gonna go, we're gonna bring the car to my side. If we okay. see yellows or reds on your side, we'll go to your side. Okay. Give me a radio check, please. All right, uh, then, so the reason why we want to be on the right or left side of the track is because following the, either one of those cones, you're going to see an L-shaped orange cone. Mm -hmm. That's your turning cone. You're going to turn in the direction that it's pointing. Mm -hmm. When it crosses your front bumper, and then you're going to look in and find that green cone on the inside, that's your apex cone. Okay. And really, all you want to do is, when you see the orange, we're going to be outside, you want to be, you know, Close to, you'll be three feet to the to that orange cone. You're gonna turn in on the inside. You're gonna see the green cone standing on the inside. You're gonna get to within three feet of that. So you're going outside an orange, inside a green. Nice smooth arc. Connect those two dots together, and that's all you're doing. You're going orange to green all the way around the track. Okay. Let's see how good I remember that when I'm on there. <laughs> <laughs> it after a while, it, I think it'll be kind of intuitive. Yeah, my only experience with any type of cone stuff, I did SCCA a couple of times. Oh, autocross stuff? Yeah. Yeah. That was fun. Yeah. A little bit, a little bit higher speeds. Yeah, you're, you're <laughs> hitting like 40 miles an hour. Right. So at low speeds, you'll have a little bit more assist on the wheel. As you pick up speed, it'll, it'll take some of the assist away. So you still have that similar feel. There you go. All right, so you see the two yellow cones on my side here? That's what they're going to look like. You can accelerate all the way to those two yellow cones. Once you get there, they pass our peripheral. We're going to lift off the throttle, and we're going to get over to the brake for our braking cones. The red cones here. We're going to stay on the outside for our orange cone here. As we're approaching this, go ahead and turn your head and find that green cone because that's what you're aiming for. Now this corner right here is going to tighten up on you. So go ahead and give me a little bit more steering input. Start to unwind the wheel, squeeze the throttle. We're going to go all the way to those two yellow cones on your side. All right, and 
go ahead and lift right here. What I want you to do, stay the outside for your orange cones here. We're going to let this Corvette buy on my side. So stay all the way to the outside here. We're going to let them buy on my side, okay? So stay to the outside. Don't give it any throttle until they get past us. All right, go ahead and follow them. Squeeze the throttle. We're going to go all the way to the two yellow, or sorry, two orange cones on my side. Once you get there, we're going to lift. Give me a light brake right here, a light brake. Now, when you turn in here, try to aim so that you only have to turn the wheel once if you're aiming for the orange cones on the outside. So as you approach those orange cones, start to unwind the wheel. We're going to start to squeeze the throttle. We're going to go all the way to those two yellow cones on my side. You can actually start accelerating all the way back to those orange cones. Go ahead. Find that orange cone on the outside. 
There you go. Start to unwind the wheel, start to squeeze the throttle, go all the way to those two yellow cones on my side. I can tell. <laughs> I can definitely tell. I'm 